The first seed of this video is relatively close to spawn. You can look on the screen for the coordinates. Uh, I'll go down so you can actually see it on the ground. It's not too far from spawn. And you get a large flatland area right here. Goes pretty far. It's mostly, eh, I'd say right here is when it starts getting a little rough in this general area. But it does go back all the way over there, which is pretty cool. You got some forests nearby, you got some extreme hills, you got a nice river, more forest, more plains area over there. And I believe that's a jungle way over there in that general direction, which I believe is actually close to, to spawn as well. So that's pretty much it for the seed. Let's go on to the second seed. For seed number two, the coordinates are on screen and the coordinates will also be down below as well. You're going to have a nice flat land spawn. It's not relatively close to the spawn. It's actually a couple hundred blocks in a direction. That's why you have the coordinates. Um, right here, you got a nice village right there. Got desert over there. Another village there. You got a nice swamp biome right here. You got a nether uh, portal ruins right there. A ravine right there. And that is pretty much it for the seed other than the obvious like forest and whatnot and the uh, hills over there and there you got a blacksmith uh, house right there some farms typical village so that's pretty much it for the seed let's get on to the next one the third seed is pretty much right at spawn you're gonna spawn in this general area and you're gonna have a decent amount of flat area to work with some on the desert, some in the actual grass. You have a nearby ravine that is right next to a river. And then you have a desert pyramid, a village right there, some glaciers. You got a lot to work with at the seed. Uh, let's see if there's anything I'm missing over here. There's a, yep, another village right over there. So there is that. Savannah plateaus, which usually have flat areas to work with on the top. The trees aren't too hard to remove. Got some more hills over there. And that is pretty much it. More hills over there. So yeah, flat area right at spawn. Nearby villages there and there. Seed four is relatively close to spawn. You can look at the coordinates from wherever you spawn to figure it out. You got a decent flat land area, very close. I mean, it's decent size, has a lot of flowers in there as well goes on over there and on the back side you have a snow biome also relatively close to spawn there's not too much else in the nearby vicinity other than forests kind of glacier over there extreme hills and that is pretty much it I'm sure if you look closely I mean like what I think that might be it looks like it's a pillage tower right there. So you do got some of those type of features that might be hidden away in there. Maybe a nearby village that I just don't see from this location. But let's get on to seed number five. For the final seed, we are going to spawn relatively close to the location where I'm at now. It's a pretty flat land on the... Well, yeah, I'd say it's mostly flat right there. It does get a little bit uneven right there. And the spawn is right over in that general direction around that nether portal or the ruins to the nether portal. Got some water over in that direction. Got a nice river right here. Got a swamp right there, which I believe has a village. If you look in the upper left corner, it might be visible for you. But yes, this area is a pretty good spawn for building in my opinion on the extreme hill side of things and that is pretty much it for this seed video uh, if you guys got any more uh, suggestions for other types of seed videos that you want to see put them in the comment section below and I'll see you guys next time have a nice day